Hello friends, I'm Alex from Tito Cocinerito and today we're going to make a steak sandwich. Um, we have received many requests lately for a quality steak sandwich and of course I think a good steak swat sandwich, a good quality steak sandwich requires good steak. So what you have, what you have here is uh, a medallion of the very um, same beef tenderloin that you get when you ask for a uh, Petit filet mignon from Tito Cocinerito. This is the medallion that you get. But what we're gonna do today, we're gonna open this into a strip so it will fit our, uh, our baguette here. And uh, our version of, of the pepito will have today, uh, of course, steak, bacon, cheese, and avocado. And it will be a hot, um, panini type uh, sandwich. So let's start by making a strip of this nice filet. I'm going to start from here. I'm just going to cut right through here and because I want a strip that is not thin so it can you can get a kind of a medium juicy strip that this one that you have here. That's it. So you can see that it, ha it has a a thickness uh, so I can give it a, a good uh, medium medium rare if you, if you prefer but I don't want to go and uh, cook it all the way through we're gonna season this a little bit good steak I only season with salt and pepper there's no need to add other flavors low sodium salt and still still tastes like salt but it's low sodium. Now we take all the pepper can from the other side and we turn this around. There's a little fat here, but it adds to the flavor. There you go. Very easily. And into the pan. I'm gonna. We have a hot grill here already. I just add a drizzle of oil for. I want the steak to have that nice, nice, nice contact with the grill. So we're gonna leave it here to a medium. Okay, so we have a grill or fillet. You see this nice crust and it's quite juicy. And what we, I have already Put a little mayo on my baguette. I think the strip came out bigger than my baguette, so we're gonna cut a little, cut a little piece of this. It won't go to waste. You can be assured. Um, we like it rare, so but you can choose any any donuts. So what we're going, we're going to do is that we are going to place our steak right here. I'm gonna add. A little bit of bacon to make it healthier. A little bit of cheese. And some avocado, which I'm gonna cut right now. Nice avocado, a little bit of a dark spot there. And I forgot, I'm gonna break. I'm gonna go off camera and back. You really uh, use a spoon when you're scooping avocado. It's very easy. It's much easier than with a knife. And you just can scoop thin, thin layers of, of avocado like this. Because I have a little uh, theory of sandwich architecture. You have to put the ingredients in the sandwich in a way that you can take a little bit of everything with every bite. So there it goes. We close this like this. Oh, we, we, we make loaded uh, sandwiches, so you will excuse me. Now I'm going to take a little bit of butter with my tongs and I'm going to put a little bit of this in my panini press here. On top of it too. And there goes the sandwich. Oops. We're not gonna lose our okay, but we'll leave it there. Okay. Goes in the middle. Little cloth so I won't get burnt. 
and be very careful when you bring down the top of it you want it to be like this so it won't so the ingredients won't come out of the sandwich and press it down we'll be back with the finished product in a few seconds bye bye hello friends so we we now have our our um, finished product and you have a very very good uh, steak sandwich made of beef tenderloin we're gonna cut it like this diagonally and it's been pressed and you can see um, this delicious meat here and uh, the beef the, the the bacon the avocado is gonna make a really really fine sandwich out of this uh, so we're gonna serve it like this with a little green uh, placed there my, by my better half and we hope that you enjoy this and uh, we were thinking we were thinking sorry of uh, putting this this uh, sandwich on the menu one of these days maybe next Sunday I don't know uh, but here this is Tito's Pepito take care see you next time bye bye